What is up guys, in this video we're going to be searching this CHP style unmarked police interceptor that I like to call an undercover unit and it is full of goodies. But first, we're going to be searching this 2017 Ford Taurus 3.5 liter V6 EcoBoost interceptor sedan. I just recently got her from a government fleet auction in LA. It was freshly painted from its original black and white color scheme. I'm going to show you guys everything it came with, all the goodies, all the equipment. Hit that like button for a possible biscuit? Yes? No? Maybe so? All right, just look at her. She is so sexy and aggressive. She has a dual LED wheeling spotlight and they both work. Check out this decked out push bumper by Satina with wheeling ion lights. Unfortunately, they cut them way too short so I can't even demonstrate them here. And unfortunately, the siren speaker is missing. All right, let's take a look inside. She's got ballistic panels, so she'll keep you safe from those California road rages. You can tell that the panels are still there because these three bolts right here hold the panels in place. All right, let's look in here. Oh, she's got leather seats. Unfortunately, the back seats are missing. All right, let's take a look in the back. There's a Motorola speaker and a lot of junk. So this X-frame right here, they add this on to reinforce the whole car. But unfortunately, it does have to go because the regular leather seats that I'm gonna add won't fit with this thing here. There's some type of siren control by sound off signal. This is the brain, the head unit is here somewhere. All right, let's start this baby up. Look at that, barely 30,000 miles. Beat that. All right, let's check under the hood. More. Stop it, more. All right, let's take a look in the trunk. These are my tools and a bunch of other junk. Uh, here is the sound off signal siren control head. I haven't had a chance to actually test it, but pretty sure it works. Oh, and this is the communication radio uh, Motorola Astro kind of old for a 2017 but hey this is some type of LA County area police car so you know how they love their old equipment oh check her out she is so base Check it out guys, right here we have a 2008 Ford Crown Victoria Police Interceptor. This has to be one of the, actually it is one of the sickest police interceptor unmarked undercover units I ever seen. As a matter of fact, this car is my inspiration for what I want to do with my own personal Ford police interceptor so the owner of this vehicle was a little camera shy and was refusing to be interviewed but that's okay i'm gonna try to remember everything he told me about the vehicle check it out we got some wheeling 500 mirror beams we got some cruiser window bars very nice we got a wheeling siren speaker in the back there she is Oh, check it out. Okay, let's take a quick look inside. 
Look at this. This vehicle is so clean and it is full of goodies. I'm gonna search it from the front and work my way to the back. Okay, let's see. I am, oh gum, I'm not used to searching vehicles that are this clean. It seems a little odd. Like I'm not actually scared to stick my hand in here. <laughs> Looks like he has uh, cruise control. Very cool. Not many vehicles have cruise control. He's got a Garmin GPS device right there. There's a Troy center console with a Wheelin Sencom Gold. I'm gonna demonstrate that here in a second. Uh, he has a Uniden Bearcat. Trunk Tracker 3, but unfortunately he doesn't have any stations out here in Sacramento because he's not from out here. We have a Motorola speaker, it's loose. We have a Santa Cruz gun locks, the freestanding version. This is freaking extra cool. This is... Ooh. Oh, I hear something. So sick right here, I love this thing. Looks like he has a Wheelin Raider with uh, the CHP bracket and he has a watch guard camera but it looks like uh, it's pointing this way all right let's start this baby up oh very nice starts right up let me turn off the air she's got a hundred and thirty two thousand miles let's look under the hood very clean she's dirty but clean go for it let's uh go ahead and go code three maybe we could see that okay so we are code three there's no lights up here looks like the front radar lights are not working neither are these looks like the lights in the back are working the owner just told me that these are wheelin inner edge which they look way cooler at night nice that's what i want in my car okay so he just informed me that he disabled the uh, sound so he doesn't get in trouble with the police but his air horn still works <laughs> yeah love it oh and check this out guys he has secure idle built into this system push this button and now you get take out the key and nobody could drive off with it or Take it out of gear or nothing. Take that, you Crown Vic thieves. You can't take this vehicle. Let's take a look on the other side. See if there's a biscuit in here. Oh. Pretty cool looking knife. Of course he has one of these in here. Look at this bracket. You don't see these very often. Oh, look, and he's got the magnetic bracket. See that? That's a pretty good idea. Instead of having to struggle with this, you just snap. That's it. Okay, let's see what's in the trunk. All right. Please be a biscuit. He told me he got no biscuit. So right here, we have a Wheelin Raider. Smart LED 500 series. Very nice. I never, I'm not used to seeing them this clean. <laughs> Let's take a quick look. It's a uh, amp for his radio. Havis tray. Very cool. All right, what's this? No, this is just a GoPro camera. First aid kit. So he's got some flares in here. So check this out right here. We have a seven light head CHP TA. The official real deal here. And right here we have another seven light head, but it is blank, but he has the lights right here. They're all gonna be amber. And uh, he also has the CHP shroud that goes to it. Very, very cool. So many goodies. Oh my goodness. Oh, nice. Look, those are all the covers for it. So these are Winley sixes. Very, very hard to find. Especially in white. Uh, he got a bunch of other miscellaneous things. More lights and brackets. And it looks like he just has cleaning supplies in here. Oh, check it out. This is for the license 
license plate. Very cool. Shit, what the heck's going on over here? What? I'm filming here. Move out of the way. Go around. <laughs> filming. Move out of the way. You that way. <laughs> you that way. <laughs> Damn it. Check out security. Boy's new whip. What are you trying to do? Uh, contact ET? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Look at this thing. It's freaking huge. You can't go on the drive stores with the antenna on. Oh, when does it end? Holy smokes. But yeah, uh, this is also his uh, first paint job. It's not too bad for a first timer. He could have did a little better job at sanding, but it's not bad. Not bad, not bad. Yep, so this is a old San Francisco police unit. 2011. 158,000 miles. Not bad. He's gonna have lights on the mirror beams and he's gonna have a whole setup so I'll keep you guys updated soon I'll keep you guys updated